Good day to everyone. Today I would like to show how to see your students while presenting in Google Meet. Yes, you can able to see your students while you're presenting presentation in Google Meet. Let's see how to do that. Before that, kindly subscribe Howex channel and click the bell icon so that you can get the useful videos and the notification. Yes. So this is my Google Meet application. So I have created the meeting. Two students have joined myself and two, two students is here. So now I would like to present my screen. So before that, I would like to get the presentation. My presentation with Google Slides. I just click and Google Slides. So I have prepared in the Google Slides. Yes, I just click the presentation option so I can able to see the presentation. So take some example of this presentation. Now I would like to present my screen to my students. I just click present now option your entire screen or Chrome tab anything. I just select entire screen and select my tab screen and click share option. Automatically my screen will be shared to my students. Yes. Now I can click the presentation option and I can able to present. So I can able to present my presentation to the students but I don't know what students is doing behind my screen. So my screen full of my presentation. I would like to see my students in between. I would like to present my screen. How to do the both things? Yes. Say so easy step. Just click a new tab in your Chrome browser. Type Chrome extensions. Yes, the Chrome extension you will find DLS. Just type DLS. So this is a DLS. So you can get the DLS extension. So just click DLS extension. So this is a dual screen option. Just click add to Chrome. Yes, add extension. So my extension is added in my Chrome browser. I can able to see yes. So dual screen is added here. Yeah. So now I can go to the Chrome browser. I can click a dual plus extension. I can select means automatically my screen will be divided into two part. Yes. So uh, which screen you want, you can choose according to DLS option, whether you want a big and small or small and big, whatever you want, you can arrange according to your needs. Yeah, so similarly I have made it. Automatically my screen slides will be stored into the another Chrome browser. So now I would like to present my screen. I just click a present option. So my, yes. So I can able to present my screen. I just click present now and your entire screen, the same option. Just select entire screen and share. So my students will be able to see my screen. Your entire screen will be there. I would like to present this screen. Just click present option. So my entire screen will be present. I cannot be able to see my students here you will find an option called exit full screen option just click the button exit full screen option so that you can able to see your student this side and you can able to give your presentation to your students so you can able to give the full screen option you can give your presentation to the students in between you can able to see your students list what they are doing everything will be there so you can able to shuffle according to your needs and you can give your information to your students so whatever your students is doing everything will be displayed here so here you can give stop presenting option you can select your entire screen or your window just select a window and choose only single window means the single window will be the presenting screen yeah. so this single window only the present so this window won't be displayed this window will be displayed to your students so you can peacefully present your screen yes so you can able to see your students and you can able to see your, if you want to see both your students and things means you can click and 
select your entire screen otherwise select a window so that your window this window will be present to your students yes so this is an easy step you can able to present your screen as well as you can able to see your students what they are doing thanks for watching have a good day